All right, so now I'm gonna talk about how to use the TCAN plate reader. Um, I prefer to use the eye control. I think you can also run this using the Magellan software, but honestly, I don't know how to do that. <laughs> I don't know either. <laughs> so it goes through an initialization and startup check. So hopefully these all pass. So now that the plate reader has initialized, it comes up to this window where you can pick whether you want it to read absorbance, fluorescence, fluorescence scan, which is pretty useful actually, or luminescence. You can also change the temperature, shaking, etc. The other thing you want to pick, of course, is what kind of plate you have, right? So just keep it at Griner 96 flat. So once you've picked the type of plate, you have to then tell it what type of read to perform. And you drag it over here, which is kind of dumb. But anyway, you type in what wavelength you would like to read. Before you hit start, it's useful to push this button, which will allow you to put your plate in here. So you pretend to put your plate in there, you have it closed, or you push the button to have it closed, and then you hit start. What's actually kind of nice with the TCAN is it'll give you all of your information here, your wavelengths, and it already puts it into an Excel format. What's actually really useful about the TCAN is it can do uh, fluorescence scans, so you can pick a range of wavelengths for it to measure your 